Good morning to everybody today. Going to do a real quick video here of rebuilding a piston cup. Now these are nine inch cups. Uh, we do have a 16 cell pump kit in these trucks. This particular cup came out of a uh, out of our 43 meter truck, which uh, definitely had some wear to it. This back side here, there was significant uh, build up here, so hopefully that did not scar up any cylinders in the barrel. Uh, this is a guide ring and a piston seal. I'm going to get this cleaned up. I'm going to take a 30 millimeter, zip this off, take, take these off, which sometimes can be fairly tight, and we're going to slip the new ones back on and bolt it together. And I'm going to show you how it's done. It's not very hard at all to do. Now, some people do replace the actual bolt going through. Um, probably not a bad idea. We did on the last set uh, that we uh, just rebuilt. However, uh, in the 38, when I rebuilt, I used the old bolt. Um, sometimes I don't feel like it's that crucial. We've never had any problems before in the past, but not saying that it could happen with a stretched bolt or a nut that does not thread very tight on there. So here we go. I'm going to clean this off and I'm going to pull the seal off, the guide ring, clean up the outside of this when I get down to it and uh, start putting it back together. Here we go. go. Let me put this in the vise. We're going to zip this off, pull off the rubber. Now this is a 30, 30 millimeter. Sits right in. I've got that bolt clamped in the vise. And here we go. And look at the water. Peck this top off, and then we're going to attempt to start getting these off. Yeah, so there was a lot of water in that, uh, way more than. I'm used to seeing here, so. Mm 
Okay. Give me a few minutes. Let me get this off. We're going to clean it up, put the new stuff on, bolt it together, and we'll be good. Okay. The guide ring is off and the piston seal is off. There was a lot of water in there, way more than I've actually ever seen in one. And there was a lot of little grout here inside this guide ring. So hopefully this did not do any damage to the barrels. Uh, the new cups are in, so hopefully there's no grout leaking through into the water box. That's a prime way to tell. So. I'm going to step outside. I'm going to pressure wash this off uh, just because there's a little extra on here. And I'm going to wire wheel off this extra little grout. I'm going to spread a little Dawn soap on there. I would typically put fluid film on there, but I'm going to spread Dawn soap on it. I'm going to try and slide everything back on and bolt it together. All right, everyone. Look what I happened to find. A new bolt on the workbench. So I tried to clean everything up best as possible. I'm going to go ahead and sit this down. Meanwhile, I need to go ahead. I did already put a little soap around this. And we'll slather a little bit more on here. like a glove that we will have I do feel like grease sometimes can swell certain rubber pieces up so that's why I would prefer to do it this way back piece was on. I need to tap it down. Just right. Looks good. have it everyone rebuilt ready to go into another truck when the time is right I'm gonna clean this up put this on the workbench and uh, put this on the shelf I guess and looks good well thank you all for watching little quick video there today if you could hit the like button subscribe share it with your friends much appreciated and until then we'll see you on the next one